The sport of pickleball is rapidly spreading across the country with many tennis and basketball courts being converted to allow for more play. And now the ownership group behind Ohio's only major league pickleball team is looking to open an indoor-outdoor facility in Beechwood. As News 5's John Kosick tells us, the location is not alone in finding a new use for an old building. The Beechwood Steinmart has sat empty since the discount chain closed its remaining brick and mortar locations a few years back. Its next act, though, will have nothing to do with retail, but rather pickleball. The folks behind Columbus's Pickle and Chill announcing plans to convert this space into a pickleball club, complete with 12 indoor and six outdoor courts, along with a bar, lounge, and event spaces. Yes, in the bones of this building, they see opportunity. The store itself is easily converted. And it has everything that a pickleball place needs, which is number one, good parking, number two, the right height ceiling, and number three, a flat surface. That will enable them to do a quick conversion opening by October. It's actually part of a growing trend around the country and finding a new use for an old building. It's nice to see everything getting revamped. The folks at the nearby Beachwood Truck Park can relate to that. They opened this location last summer after converting this old Beachwood fire station into a bar and food truck restaurant, holding on to the big garage doors to provide a free flow to the outside. The old firehouse was something that was really well known around here. So even when we started, you know, bringing the trucks in and redoing everything, Everyone was always looking over, like, what's going on here? Not far away in Shaker Heights is yet another recently opened conversion. As an old movie theater turned clothing store turned pet shop is now the 1899 Social Club. Featuring indoor golf, a lounge, restaurant, and a lot more, making the most of what the old building has to offer. I love old architecture. You know, we kept a lot of the exposed brick. Uh, the ceiling height is amazing. So we were able to use that kind of unique building to create a really fun, uh, kind of chic atmosphere in here. Back at the Pickle and Chill site, customers at the Pavilion Shopping Center welcome the news. The building's been vacant, other than uh, some temporary for like Halloween stores for a couple of years. So yeah, anytime you can do something to develop the business, it's great. Even better. Oh, wonderful. Judy, if you're like Cece and play pickleball. We go down to Florida every winter and everybody down there plays. It's great activity. All ages can play. It's so much fun. In Beachwood, John Kasich, News 5. Pickle and Chill says since November, it's taught 1,200 people how to play pickleball, in addition to hosting people who already know how to do it. I'll have to learn how to get on that one, Rob Court. Have you not played pickleball yet? I haven't yet. You know, I just run. That's it. We'll have to do it together. How about that? I'm with you. Let's do it. Courtney, you in? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm, I'm game for anything. All right. I know how to play tennis. It's Only, close, right? It's, it's close. <laughs> you need to find a fourth. Mark. Hello. <laughs>